the same. Then C part, to find new strategies for effective follow-up and increase in participation. So we are going to find a new strategy for effective follow-up. For instance, if you join the church and we are visitor, you raise your hand. If you come to church personally, you raise your hand. We have membership team. Somebody will call you by 6 p.m. Somebody will just give you a phone call by 6 p.m. And those who take that they want to become members, then we reach out to them and show them how they will become members. So that is one of our strategies. But I also found that most visitors don't raise their hands. They feel shy. That's why after service, I catch them at the gate. Because I've been here so long that I know people who are not part of the church. So for them to slip through, I always pick them outside. Then give them forms to fill so that they could also be raised. But you will give us other strategies that you think we can use to be able to reach out to more people. Then the fourth one, D, church group, D, to strengthen the shepherding concept to provide people care and discipleship for the church. The 2020, we decided that every church member will be allocated to a shepherd. The shepherd shepherds 10 members. And some people, the sad thing is that some people, when they are shepherds, call them. They don't pick their phone. And some people, when shepherds send text messages, they don't respond. So it makes the shepherding system, their shepherds are trying their very best, but majority of people have become redundant. So it makes it difficult. So this year, we want to find strategies where everybody who is part of the church, we allocate them shepherds and make sure they reach out to you. Some change their phone numbers, you call, it doesn't go. And they will inform their shepherd. So all these backdoor loopholes, we want to seal it. So the shepherding system, here we have 45 shepherds. I increase it to one. So West Croydon, we have 50, 46 shepherds. That's times 10. So 460 people are being shepherded. West Noble have 10. Akan service also have about eight. So you see that that number alone, if we can contain them, we are reaching our target of 1,000 and over gradually. Then also ye, ye to organize our committees and ensure that all departments are well structured. So we have various committees in the church where new members come, we allocate them to committees. They decide where they want to serve. Those who want choir, we always send them to choir, ushering, protocol. So we want to see how we can make the committees become very effective in every department. For instance, I used to work with somebody who goes to KICC. I've told the person that I am Trinity Baptist Church member. But every time they are doing something at KFCC, he will bring a lift in. Oh, Steve, is there any way you can squeeze one day? It's five-week program. I have told him I have a check. But every time they are doing something in Korea, he will bring me a copy of the leaflet. He's not taking chances. Are you understanding me? <laughs> this is taking somebody by force. And those are some of the strategies. The other day also, I went to PC Word, credit, carries. And somebody is standing there Saturday. He has three business cards of his church address. Times that they meet. Then you are just slotting to visitors. You read there, oh, we fellowship. Their church is very close to St. Andrews. You know that side. He said, oh, we are very close to this place. If you don't have any place to fellowship, visitors. Next month, we are doing praise and worship. Will you come and just, it's free. Just come and join. I said, wow, business cards with the church location on it. Inviting people at a shopping center. Because it's not very bulky for you to take. You just slip it in your hand. Okay, so people use so many strategies. So our department will also look at that. Then F, to plant new churches, to, to establish a church planting team. So we need to plant new churches. For instance, most of our members are now, because of the cost of living in London, we have seen that TBC, most of our members are going to Kent. So such people, if you are doing program, you are inviting them to come to Friday prayer meeting, it's very, very difficult. Are you understanding me? So is there a way we can decide, that, okay, the people in the Kent will plant church there. Then during the week, they can be meeting, like house fellowship. Then Sundays, once a month, they come and join the mother church. So those are some of the strategies Pastor is having. The locations that our people are there, why not form? A, so this year, the target is two church plants. And we have some people who are also living in Crawley. 
Gatwick area. Most people are moving there now. So there are so many strategies to reach out to those people also. Then G, to be involved in missions for Northern Ghana and Jamasi in the Ashanti region. Northern Ghana, we had the opportunity of going there in October last year, visiting Pastor Ito. If you go there, there is a lot of work. There are so many villages that they need missions, sending them food items, sending them clothing, and other, in Jamasi also. Pastor will speak on that more. There has been a requirement there also. Then, to have, H, to have an up-to-date database of members to enable us to keep a constant touch with our members. Every, during the COVID, we didn't do a lot of membership update, but this 31st, we did it. We saw that there are so many ghost names in our database. We go and count, it's approaching 3,000, but you see that somebody have left church a long time. Their names are still there. Somebody have migrated to Ghana. Their names are still there. So we want to get effective database, then we see that anybody on our system, because what happens is that when people are applying for schools, the first thing we do is that when they post the form, they bring us to sign the form. I fill a form for my daughter at Archbishop Tennyson. They will write to us. When it comes, the first contact point is the check database. So when we check and your name is not there, it's risky. Then they will come and ask me, Pastor, is that, has that person gone through membership? Then we check. For instance, let me give you a typical example. Somebody lost their baptismal certificate. And the person did baptism in 2004. And if you are going to the civil service, please, army, all those places, they will ask you for your proof of Christianity. So your baptismal certificate is the one normally they want. So the person just sent his uncle, who continued to come to church. He has migrated outside London. Then the uncle came during the week that he needs baptismal certificate. So we don't do it like that. We have to get in contact with that person. So we contacted the person. He said, you finished 2004. We check our database. His name was there in the baptismal list for 2004. So we gave him authority that his uncle, you should just send an email that his uncle should collect consent. And we release it for him. You see, so such a person has been able to note at the time he did baptism. 2004, we have it on our system. So these are some of the things we want to cross-check so that ghost names can be fished out. Because such a person, he did baptism, but he's no longer with us. So his name shouldn't continue to be with us. Are you understand? He has moved outside London. So these are some of the things we want to look at. Then I, to grow Sunday attendance. So the 2,000, pastor, I break it into that. And this is the area we we'll break ourselves into small group to see how we can achieve those targets. The 2,000 for this year by 31st December in West Norwood and here, we want the account service to have constant 350 members every week. So that is Pastor Sly and the team, Nana and the rest. That is, you have to strategize. And they have their strategy. They have their strategy. They saw that funerals, funeral gathering, so many visitors. So they have done cuts that when they go to any function, whether birthday, 60 plus birthday or funerals, they will be witnessing to people with those cars with all the time the three account service meet. So they think that through that they will get their 350. 400, okay, 400, thank you. So through that they will get their 400. Then West Nord with English service, 350. So everybody in West Nord with English service, they have to strategize how they will get their 350 this year. They also have the evangelism card. The impact service, we want them to achieve 300 by 31st December. So Pastor Kwame, Pastor Leandre, and the team, they have to strategize because now every Sunday they are approaching 200. So we want them to push it. By 31st December, they have 300 young people meeting here. Then the youth, 250. The youth, 250. So they must also, Pastor Kunle, NK, and the Pastor Doga, the rest of the team, they have to strategize how they will get 250 by the end of this year. Then crowding main service, Oasis House, 700. Because now Sundays, we are in the 500 range. So we need to push it to 700 by 31st December. Every Sunday, we get more than 500. So we need to push it to the 700 by 31st December. So that is all. And also to strengthen our missions to the universities. These days, when you go to universities, it's like 
the time that the European countries were coming to scramble for Africa, if you have that history, there was a period, the Portuguese were coming, the English were coming, everybody wanted to get Africa. Now when you go to universities, so many churches trying to capture young people. But we have to strategize. How do we keep our people in contact with us? Because there's social media, we show our things online. How do we make sure that our children, when they go to university, some other groups don't come and kidnap them with different doctrines from what we have taught them? So those are also strategies we look at this year. So now in the next 15 minutes before we hand over to Pastor Bobby Hill, we are going to group ourselves into five groups and we are focusing mainly on how do we get the 2,000 membership. So everybody, every group, you will bring your ideas and pastor wants us to write all of them down. So we'll give you sheets, post it, then every group, you plan yourself, how do you reach this number that has been distributed into various fashion? Bring ideas, how do you think the bi-monthly evangelism will get the whole church or 90% to join us? So these are the things we are going to discuss. So we'll go line by line. We are counting to five, then we start again. We are breaking into five groups. So let's start with Pastor Johnson. Please, and every group, nominate one leader who will be writing your ideas. Three, four. Is it good to last? Five. Three. Four. I'll come to that side later. Two, a uh, Joe, two, three, next line, Emilia, five, four, Emilia, you are four, one, Eja, uh, four, Jazz is five, one, two, you, two, three, four, five. Five. One, two, three, three, five. One, two, three. Okay, now let's go to the outside people. Okay, so we will count them. I didn't do them. Okay, I'll count them. Sorry. So one, one, two, three. Mr. Doc has four. Brother Amwa, five. You are number five. Okay, let's go to the extreme end. Kule, you are one. Okay, we are distributing to you. You are one, two, three, four. Kami. Dwight, you are five. Rochelle is one. Okay, we go to the last session and we break ourselves up. So sorry, you are two. Three, four, Nikki is four, five, one, three, four. Anybody up there? Sister Evelyn, five. Who is next to you? One, two, three. Good. So please, four, five. Good. So please, all ones decide. All twos decide. All threes decide. This side, all fours, that side, and all fives, the tier system behind us. Please, all ones, that side, where Pastor Kwame is, all twos, middle side, all threes, this side, all fours, that side, all five, tier system in the middle here, the tier sitting up here, all fives. Please appoint a group leader. Appoint a group leader. Strategies of achieving the 2,000. Strategies for achieving 2,000. All ones, all twos, all threes, all fours, all five. Tia sitting up there. So strategies where we'll get the whole church to be involved 
in achieving our 2,000 thousand. Four is here. Four is here, three is here, two is here, one is towards the gate. Five up there. Five up there, please. One, two. One is where Dr. Chris is. Two, Sister Pat and Pastor Michael. Three, Brother Raphael's group. Yeah, three is Brother Raphael's group. Four, Nikki's group and Pastor Sly's group. Five up there. We are planning to bring any ideas, including social media or whatever, how we we'll achieve our 5,000 targets. So that's your discussion. And I'll bring you a sheet and appoint a secretary who will be writing your point. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> 